Hello, welcome to njsarpon.com YouTube channel. I am Vijay, a Microsoft MVP, and in this video, I am going to explain you how we can customize Quick Lunch or the left navigation and the top navigation in SharePoint online sites. The same way you can customize for SharePoint on premises sites like your SharePoint 2016, 2013, or even SharePoint 2019 sites. So let's open the SharePoint site. So this is the SharePoint site that I'm going to customize the top navigation or the left navigation. So you can see here, this is the left navigation or the quick launch, and this is the top navigation. So here I'll explain you three approaches, how we can add links or how we can edit links or how we can delete links. So two, uh, one basic approach, which uh, we used to follow in SharePoint 2010 sites and another one, advanced one those two are covered in SharePoint 2013 this is really cool to use those features so to add a link in the left navigation you can see here there is an edit link option is there so you click on the edit link and you will be able to delete here if you want to delete you can click on this cross icon and it will delete and if you want to add a link then you can click on this add link option and once you'll do this it will ask you to have the text to display so you can put any text to display you can even give external links on that so before going to that if i'll go to the site content page so i have two sub sites on this so i'll go to the site content page now and here you can see here two sub sites are there one finance and one hr sub sites are there so what we can do is here we are going to add these two links in the left navigation so click on add links and if you'll see here i'll say hr and i want to give the hr link so i'll take this link and i'll paste it here and i'll say okay you can see here hr link comes here if you want to um, you know change the order or something you can just drag it and wherever you want to put you can put it you can see here i put it below the home icon and if you want to delete it you can just cross it if you want to change a uh, link then you can just click on this and you can see here edit a link is coming click on that and here you will be able to get the same dialog box edit link and you can change the link or the text whatever you want let's say i'll say hr team click on ok and now save it so you can see here let's refresh the page again you can see here hr team is coming now the other way you can do it i'll go to the site settings and in the site settings page you will see one option as quick lunch which is under look and feel so quick lunch click on that and here you will be able to add it you can put a new heading altogether, and within that you can put your new navigation links or you can also directly put so i'll click on this uh, let's first click on the new heading so you can see here i'll say new heading and i can give a heading for this so i can say the heading i'll put google url here i'll just to show it so you can see here it will come see one heading comes now within that if you want to put some other things you will be able to put it so i'll say new navigation link and you can see here i'll put a link over there now what we'll do is we'll put our finance site so i'll copy this url i'll take it and i'll say finance and if you want to put any heading you can uh, choose that heading under which you want to put it so you can put that and i'll say okay so now if you'll see here it is coming under your heading stuff so this way you will be able to add it over here in this uh, uh, this links you can edit it so you can click on this anytime in the edit icon so if you'll see here you can see here you can edit it and you can uh, do that you can put this way over there in the uh, left navigation or the quick launch also now the same thing how we can do for the top navigation is if you'll see here there is a edit link same things are available over here i'll click on the edit and here i'll say 
finance team and i'll put the address so i'll take the finance team url i'll put it here and then i'll say save so you can see here finance team is already there now in the top navigation the same way you will be able to do in the other approach where you can go to the site settings and it's a typical classic approach you can see here top la top link bar is there so click on this top link bar and then if you'll see here i can add a link over here i'll say now uh, i'll put the hr link so i'll go and just paste the hr link i'll say hr team i'll click on ok now if you'll see here in the top navigation also hr team will appear so i'll go to the home you can see here already h1 hr team is there so this way you'll be able to add links in the top navigation and the left navigation i'll show you one more thing that you can also now drag and drop and put it so when you are doing drag and drop not only to any list or library you can add to pages documents list item anything so let's go to the site content page i'll go to the site content page here and what i'm trying to do now here is i will i'll try to add the documents links over the top navigation so i'll edit the link you can see here i edit the link and i'll copy this you can see here i simply drag and drop and i put it here i left it and i'll say save now if you'll see here the document has been there in this one so i'll simply click on that you can see here it is opening the document library so not only the um, documents or the list you will be able to open or you will be able to add the document individual document or pages or any item links also so let's say i'll say edit the link and i want to put these documents over there in the left navigation somewhere so i can simply drag it and you can see here text dev document is there so i can put some link on the left side so you can see here these two links we have added so i'll click on save and now if you'll see here the two links are already added into that so not only for the uh, you know for the um, documents library or in the any items so you'll be able to put the um, any pages also you have in the pages library document library you'll be able to put that so from the site content anywhere you can take any um, any 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 link and uh, you will be able to add it so this will be available for both the left navigation and the uh, top navigation so i hope you enjoyed this video if you really like the videos kindly subscribe comment and uh, do like us uh, like all these videos and uh, never forget to subscribe you'll get notification on the new videos that we are uploading thank you and have a nice day